Okay, I'm reloading. <laughs> yeah, dead center, boy. All right, guys, heading up to OK Corral to shoot. Got a special guest with me today, and we about to pull out the artillery. I didn't bring all the artillery, but I brought some. Got to keep some to the, you know, imagination and stuff like that. So we about to head up here. Let's get it. All right, guys, we are almost here. Took me an hour and 30 minutes to get here, but when I tell you it's beautiful out here, it is beautiful, man. This is crazy. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at this, y'all. Oh my God. Y'all gotta see this. You see the waterfall? That's crazy. Look at that. Beautiful. All right, guys, so we have made it to OK Corral. What city is this in? We in Woodbury, guys. So we were in Woodbury, Tennessee. When I tell you it is beautiful, it is beautiful. And you already know what time it is right there. I'm not from this planet, ITT. And then here go the lodge right here where you go in and sign in. It's only 10 bucks. And of course, uh, prices are probably subject to change, guys. So that's the lodge that there. You hear the shotgun going off and everything like that. I got my buddy with me today, guys. And I know you remember this face right here. Yeah, and we about to get into it, guys, and shoot some amazing play. things. So get ready for the madness. All right, guys, we are here. Check it out. We about to get it in. All right. I got your favorite guy from the gun alert videos here today. <laughs> oh, yeah. Y'all hear the phone ringing. I'm ignoring everything. What are we shooting today, sir? We're shooting a lot of different things. Oh, boy. So Should we make it a surprise for him? We'll make it a surprise. Yeah, let's get it, guys. And this is where we're at. This is what you get right here. You'll hear the gunshots in the background. And as you can see, it's a lot of shotgun shells. I don't know, you just heard one, guys. We got our little table set up here. Uh, I don't know what that is. It's like a little boo. Oh, that's pretty close. That shotgun, yeah. Oh, look at that. This is nice, guys. So we about to really, really get it in. All right, guys. So we unloading the truck. Oh, boy. And look what we breaking out. Yeah, buddy. What we got here? Is it a surprise? It's a surprise. Oh, boy. So yeah. We have a uh, Sig P320, but we've already swapped out the grip. This is the original. We have a Sig P320 M18 military version with full size Smith & Wesson M&P 2.0. We have a Sig Sauer P938. And then the creme de la creme we have, uh, which hadn't been shot yet, so this would be a first. It's gonna uh, be fun. 410 Shockwave. 410 Shockwave? 410 Shockwave, guys. All right, that's it. And I brought the Maverick 88, the big boy, so we can load up some slug, <laughs> some double lock buck. We about to get it in. All right, guys, this is my first time coming here. And this, when I tell you it's so serene and beautiful out here, just look. I mean, seriously, it's just crazy. And it's nobody around, and I love it. All right, guys, we got another surprise. Y'all know we had to put the AK-47. Had to, had to do it. Oh yeah, and we got some more surprises here too, guys. So I got some more stuff coming out the truck, so we about to, we about to get it in. Guys, you gotta look at this. The ground, when we step on it, is nothing, like I said before. But shotgun shells, literally, everywhere you look. It's crazy, guys, look at that. Everywhere, I mean, it's just littered with it. Y'all know we about to get it in. Oh yeah. Time to have some fun. I brought some of the toys out. Oh, target's falling. You guys will see what that is in a few minutes. We're doing our setup right now to get everything set up. I'm gonna grab these targets. They kind of rough looking because I had them in a the trunk, guys, so. It's okay, they're gonna be used. 
Where should I put this? Well, maybe I can put it up here so it doesn't fly away. The wind is a little bit high, guys, so might not work. Maybe I need to put this. I'm gonna put the herders. Damn. Bet you that don't go anywhere. Let me go ahead and put the rest of the toys up. Yeah. Oh, you bought. The, oh, that's the Sig P320. Yes. Oh, I gotta shoot that. Yeah, I gotta shoot that. Look, look what I bought you. I don't know if you oh, ever shoot. shot one. I haven't shot a mechanic. mechanic. Yep. Well, you will today. So this was look the at that 40 Smith and Wesson. Nice. I don't know if you ever shot that. Of course, you shot a Glock before. Yep. Yep. So this is the original grip. 15 round mag that was on here. This is the one we talked about in the video the other day. Okay. This is basically a full size X carry. Okay. I cannot wait to shoot this shit right here. So 17 rounds. So I have to borrow from the uh, the M17 to do that. All right. But we still got that. And guess what else? I, uh oh. Oh, it's so small. It's in here. <laughs> I couldn't see it. Look what else I brought. Oh, nice. A little bitty Ruger. I haven't shot that way yet. Well, you yeah. shoot it today. We're going to have some fun. We got, oh, we got a nice spread. And it's even more than that. I got the shotgun down here. Where did I do with the shot? Here it is. Get a load of that. Oh. You get to shoot it today. <laughs> About to have some fun. And look what I put on the tip of it. That's, that's what your guy was talking about nice in the alert video you know what i mean might have to take a look at that for the uh yeah for the shock wave. you can set that on the table that's gonna get shot today and we, i got the ar-15 too we loaded or we're clear huh we loaded or we're, we're clear. completely clear check it though make sure make sure i'm clear okay we're yep. clear i'll check that last night Look, so you can set that i guess move it yeah Hey guys, every gun that goes on the counter here, we're basically making sure everything is clear, everything is everything is everything clear. is racked. Yep. Rack that one. Make sure. Empty. That's it. Yep. We're clear. No magazine. We're all empty on everything. So yep. they're not going to basically chamber anything until such time as we're ready to shoot. That's Otherwise right. it'll stay this you, way. Did you bring the AR? Yeah, AR. No, you were bringing the AR. I got the AR. You got the AR. Yeah. <laughs> here it is. Thank you. Well, my hands are so cool with this. And she's beautiful. And you know I got the five time magnifier on that boy. Ooh. Oh, pretty. Ooh. And you know what? <laughs> You're going to have your haters talking about the sight marks. But guess what? If they listen, they're buying them $500, you know, red dots and optics. And a bunch of people don't even know how to shoot with them. And I bet you I hit my target with that. I've sold a handful of these as the pair and as an individual. I'm really curious now to see this. I'm going to be buying myself a Psychmark Wraith. Well, we about to play with it today. And you see it got a little weight on it. And I got the bipod in the inside too, just in case. So, yep. Hang on. Yeah, hold that right there. I'm going to get you on film. Okay, magazine is out. Chamber, Chamber is clear. Empty. Yep. Yep, that's my little baby right there. We're going to have fun, guys. Oh, we're going to have some fun. Oh boy, ITT. You know what time it is, guys. Oh, what you shooting with? But this one you were telling me about. So this is uh, Hornaday Critical Defense. It's only 100 grain. Mm -hmm. um, this obviously is pink, so this is uh, not Ivan and I handing in our man cards. For us. <laughs> and we're going to test it in a, in a few things here. I've only got one box of it, but I want to see what it's going to actually go through. Okay. So there are some guns that don't like to cycle the less lesser uh, uh, grains. We're just going to check it out for the ladies as we do talk to the ladies when they're buying their first uh, gun or their second gun that we know that we can recommend this to whether it's going to work or not. Perfect. All right, guys. And then in the shotgun, we're shooting uh, double out buck. We're also shooting slugs. And I think he got buck shot for that, um, uh, for that other one, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, boy. <laughs> We brought the guns out and it would have been more than this guys but some of my other guys didn't come out yeah headset uh yeah 
Earmuffs, what kind of you got? Walkers? That's what Walkers, I have too. Uh, yeah, them the carbon fiber ones too. What's that? 410 uh, target loads. All right. Well, we got a few of them. Okay. Go big or go home, guys. Go big or go home. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. You know how we do. Yeah, boy. Yeah. And we got Chiquita Banana. Chiquita. Chiquita. Yeah. You got to love that. Yeah. The VersaCarry holster. If you're looking for something comfortable, you use the code TEXT, T-E-X-T, 25 at checkout. They do have a sale on these right now. They're going for $45. This one is for the uh, P365X in the uh, original version. Same holster. This is the one for the P938. Most comfortable holster that? I've had. That was some weird shit. <laughs> it was almost some... like some, came, some shrapnel came over here. We got some visitors up at the top yeah, on this, so we we'll, we'll figure it out. And oh, and is this the, um, don't tell me. This is the uh, Night Hawk. Safari Land. Damn, Safari Land, yeah. Safari Land duty holster, uh, paddle, leg strap. Kudos go to Safari Land. If you ever order from Safari yeah, that Land, was a cool. they will tell you expect 30 day delivery. Okay. It will show up at your doorstep at about day 29, day 30. All right. So don't ask for where it's at. That's it. <laughs> All right, guys. So we're about to get set up here. We will be right back. All right. What are we about to get into here? We're about ready to get in. We're loading up, uh, deciding real quick. I'll probably start with, I don't know what I'm gonna start with. That's a SIG. We'll load this guy up. We'll get uh, one of the two SIGs here going first. Oh, tell them what we what we forgot. So the most Guys, important something thing to think so about here, simple. buy one of these, bring it. Bring it. Get the heavy duty one. It's not that much more money. Because, and throw it in your vehicle. Because if you come to a range like this, you're definitely gonna need it. Because as you take and put targets up down there, that's us hanging targets right now. You'll notice there's nothing up there because we didn't have one of these. Yeah, we were scrambling to try to figure it out, guys. So they graciously loaned us one, so we're going to take care of this. But if you do come down here, bring your stapler. That's right. All right, guys, so we're about to get into it. You hear the shotgun in the background. I'm not from this planet. I got a special guest with me today. We were going to have some more guys out here to shoot. But guess what? We're still going to get it in, guys. And he's great with the camera. I might have to put him on payroll, but uh, we're about to get it, guys. We're going to put two targets up. We probably may put a little bit more up, but we're going to start with two. So let's get into this. All right, so I'm putting the targets up, guys. The stapler. Got one there. We got two so far. We're going to do three today. One more target. I always keep these on deck in the car. I'll put one over there by the, uh, by two. Should I put it in front of two or behind two? Uh, right here? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. That way we got some stuff to aim at. Y'all know I had to bring bright black and white girl, but wait till I get the Jeep, the Rubicon. Y'all gonna really see some footage. Rubicon is coming. And guess what guys, we had to get some snacks. You know we had to get snacks. Ammo galore, it's more ammo than that. And Vortex. Water, H2O, life. Five at a time. Where your reloader? I got a reloader. Uh, my, forgot mine. You did? Yep. You got those M&P uh, glasses, guys. Those mugs are super dope. Walkers, we don't do nothing but walkers. That one is for the cannon. Yep. That one is for the 40 Smith and Wesson. 
and a Ruger. Did I put? Where's the Ruger? Oh, oh, it's probably on the side in there. You feel it? Oh, there it is. Yep. Ready to go. Okay, so have rounds, have rounds, have rounds, have rounds. Rounds, rounds, rounds. We're good. Yeah. All right, guys. And we got the targets up. I'll zoom in, let you guys see that. That way we can be a little mobile and move a little bit, which is really cool. All right. And look at the dirt, guys. It's like straight up red out here. And if y'all want to see this, this is crazy. I mean, there's literally nobody around here. I love it. It's nice and quiet. That's how we like it. You ready, Chip? Ready. We started originally with the compact grip, 15 round in the mag and in the uh, grip. Swapped it out for an X carry. Uh, extended the basic magazine to a uh, uh, 17 as the basic. I have it loaded up in a borrowed uh, 21 round. So I am going to holster this. We're locked into place. I feel a little loose, that's weird. Second shot, nasty. Clear. That was fun. Yeah. That was fun. <laughs> that was fun. That was really fun. All right, guys, it's AK time. You ready? Ready. All right, let's we get got it. the Chiquita banana. We're gonna move down here to the end. Or you just want let's let's go ahead and just take some rounds off on this. Oh boy. There you go, my friend. Yeah. How's the recoil? It's a little tight, but uh, it's manageable. How many more you got? Uh, the magazine's full. Let me get a couple. I got to get some fun on that one. Yeah. Okay. Ivan and the Chiquita Banana. Dang, this stock is so small. Yeah. It's hard to get in the shoulder. Yeah! Okay! I'm reloading. <laughs> hey, dead center boy. Talk to daddy. Hey, oh, I love this. I can't wait to get one of these. You see how much center I'm hitting? Yeah. Nothing but red. <laughs> Guys, I'm in love. <laughs> All right. This mug's smoking. Come look at the smoke. 
Oh, it's the lens is not. You can turn it. Turn it this way. Okay, now come up on it. It's smoking, guys. All right, here we go, sir. You got a jam? Huh? You got a jam? I do? No, 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 it's not a jam. Oh, it is a jam. There you go. Came out. Yeah, it is. It's a stove pipe up in here. There you go. Look, hot? Nope. That was fun. That was fun. Oh my goodness. I gotta get one of these. <laughs> Got to. Should we move to the next one? Yeah, that was, man. That was so fun. Like Dude, you see how dead center I was hitting? Yeah. Nothing but red almost. Yeah. Like red, good. red, it, it was nothing but red. Yeah. Like, I don't know. I And I'm gonna have to center in this. Hopefully I can get her tight enough to... You want to have some more AK? Oh, I thought you was going to get some more AK fun. No, let's move on. You, uh, you want the shotgun? Let's do the shotgun. Okay. I'm going to let you have some fun on my shotgun. Um, let, me, let me try this one out first. Okay. Okay. 410. 410. <coughs> Give him the inaugural run here. No, I didn't need double protection because no. we're outside. It's not bothering me. Yeah, no, there's not a whole lot of... Uh, the, the sound is able to travel. Yeah. It's not bouncing off of the concrete walls. Yeah. Man, that AK was something else. I Oh, my goodness. I got to get one. There is It got some recoil, though. One just failed. Yep. Yeah, just do five. Stick with my five. Yeah, that's all. That's good. We got more toys to go to. Okay, we are safe. Which one are you trying to? You might. Yeah, if it's a shotgun, you might as well dump off on that one. Hey everybody, this is uh, almost a home defense type of a shotgun or a uh, RV type shotgun. It's 410 Birdshot. The 410 Birdshot is very popular in the RV community. <laughs> oh you hit center on that too didn't you yeah <laughs> get the uh get the other two <clears throat> so you got to put them in there in there that's what it is it doesn't like it to be it's bad yeah now we go <laughs> Elmer Fudd style. Goodness gracious. Bird shot, guys. It's nasty. Oh. Just imagine what could happen. We're clear. Okay. I'm going to go to show these guys. <laughs> this is, oh my goodness. <coughs> it's not a good day, guys. It's not a good day. I am liking that. That is not a good day. My goodness. <laughs> well, all right. You want to try my shotgun now? It's going to be a different experience with the 88. Yeah, let's try that one. Then we'll do this. We'll uh, change rolls. All right. I like this. Yeah, that little thing's sweet. And them, them, them bird shots, man, that's something deadly. You can use what's on the side. That's fine. And keep in mind, I got them stack, uh, staggered. So you got buck shots, and then you may have some double out buck. I mean, you got um, slugs and maybe some double out buck in there too. So okay, there's buck. It, yeah, maybe it's all buck, isn't it? It's four buck. Four buck. Yep, gonna load that boy up. It's a beautiful day out here, guys. I believe it holds five in that tube. 
All right. Go to the second one. Oh, I'm liking that sight. Huh? That sight? that sight? Listen, that's why I put it on there. That's why your guy at the shop said, I had that on there before he said that. I love that, man. Now, this going to give you some recoil, so break for it. She's a big boy. Yeah, buddy. Oh, my goodness. Hey! Rocking him. Yeah. Hey! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> How you feel, sir? That feels pretty good. I know you love that. You know... Nothing like the smell of gunpowder in the morning. <laughs> I can tell you was really liking that. We clear? We're clear. Oh, she's a beauty. That's why I love that 88, man. That Maverick 88. She's a beauty. Not for the RV community. No, not at all. <laughs> yeah, that, that's, a, that's a bad... Oh, my goodness. Let's look at the damage. So imagine someone coming into your house, guys. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, can I stick it in? Oh, boy. <laughs> man even through the wood damn wow like crazy <laughs> all right let's see what i'm gonna get on let me get some of that shotgun after i don't know i really want let me get the p let me get your p i want the p320 okay yeah p320 all right all right here we go I'll let you hold it. And no, you can go up and down. Okay. You got to do it really lightly. You got it? Okay, okay. you're not chambered. Okay. Uh, you've only got five. Huh? You got five. I want more. I only put five in, man. <laughs> I want five. I can, I can do some. You want me to get some of my ammo? Oh, you're good. You're good. Okay. Let's see. Five. I do just nine. All right, so I'm grabbing a cannon. So Ivan with the P320 for the first time. Let's get it, boys and girls. Should I do a, a Sassalese stance or a weaver? Do five on one and five on the other. Dang, this feel good. Make sure you get, yeah, get on the, get on the side because this one going on a review. Okay. This is light with recoil. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Get it on red. This is nice. This is nice. That was nice. That's nice. I like this. It's no hardly no recoil, guys. That's crazy, man. And the grip. So let's go straight to the M18. The P320 M18. All right. Nice. Man, I like this. It's like no recoil hardly. We moving fast, too. <laughs> Be getting that footage in this is uh which one is this again this is the uh p320 18 so this is the one that deployed to the military service. okay so you got 10. Right. yeah but you guys seen this in the gun alert video this is a gun alert video all right somebody got Woo! yeah buddy all right you ready to rock Let's get it. Oh, you, you want me to do it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, shoot, shoot it back to back. <laughs> yeah. 
slight difference, but there's not a whole lot. A lot of it's the grip. It's lightweight. A little weight in the handle a little bit. It's a little weight. Smooth like butter. Yeah. Yeah. That was nice. I like the other one better because the handle feels a little chunky, but I like it. And it's lightweight. I can't explain how lightweight this is. This is nice. This is nice. Nice. Very nice. I really like it. All right, what are we up next? You know you want to. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. We got any, uh, where are the shelves? All right, let me set these up here. I'm gonna go back to, where should I go? I might as well just do this one. Yeah, finish that one off. All right. I hope it don't jam on me. Two. Three. Four. Got one more. Five. This feels so weird with this Raptor grip. Yeah. Feels strange. But I like that strap. And I want to shoulder it so bad. <laughs> hey, talk to me, baby. I like this. This is fun. Yeah. That's a fun toy. I didn't like the Raptor grip at first, but now I like it. Man. All right. All right. We clear? Yep. Set this here. It's hot, too. So all we have left is the AR. The AR and a couple of handguns. We got the AR and a couple of handguns. What do you want to do next? Uh, let's the, do the two six. Huh? Let's do the two six first. Okay. So guys, this is a uh, Sig P938. Seven round in the magazine, another one in the tube. We're not doing the one on the tube today. It's a 1911 platform. It does come in two variants. So one variant is a six round magazine. This is basically what it looks like with a six. Highly recommend the seven round because I like my pinky on my gun. Seven round magazine gives me a full grip that I want. We're all good and ready to go. Let's get it. And we're also going to take up the uh, Sig P three sixty five. Let's take both both of them up. Save on time. Yeah. Go to the right here. I'm following you. I'm about to do a quick three sixty on. Them. <laughs> My temporary holster. Nice. Oh, that's nice grouping. It was. Let's see if I can match it. On the shoulder. Rotator cut problems. <laughs> that boy got some rotator cut problems now. What Did it jam? Oh. I'm not firing. Oh, I had safety. Okay. See, I know what it is. It's the, you're aiming at the top, right? 
Yeah. Oh, you're doing good. Yeah. You almost hit the red. Those have more recoil. Yeah. You put the left one in here. So guys, the only small issue with this is basically the safety is right here. So part of the recoil, my hand hit it, put it back into place. That's when we weren't firing. So slap, rack, slap, check your safety. Yep. One round to go. There you go, right in the neck. Esophagus leaking. Sorry, doctor. We're clear. It's hot. A little warm. Yep. It's all good. That's it. Good for that. Back at it, guys. Doing good timing, too. All right, what are we up next? It's AK time? I mean, uh, AR-15 time? AR time. Okay, guys, we got a Ruger 556. MPR. Thank you. I didn't know all those. It's all good. Reloaded. And he slapped it. She likes that. Oh, wait, red dot. Gotta turn the red dot on. Yep. Keep your finger down on it. Okay. I don't know. Look in the sight and see if it's on. There it is. I'm gonna pick a different sight. So, guys, this sight mark is it ultra spec? It's an ultra spec. Is it showing? Yeah, it's. I got it. You have like five or six different reticles that you can actually swap it to. If you just don't want to look at a little red dot, you can have other things you can look at. Yep. Because as you know, as we get older, I like to look at bigger things. <laughs> there you go. Now, I don't know if this is, I don't know if I zeroed that in properly. So it might not be zeroed in properly. Find out real quick. Yeah. Safety probably on. Is it on? I bet you. <laughs> nope, yep. we're fire. Okay. Nah, I need a table and a bag. I know, it'd be better. Damn. You almost hit that. Damn. This was off to the left, just a little bit. You see that? Yeah. To the red. I got my tools to try it without the magnifier and see if you can hit. That thing is loud, man. Yeah, see, it's going off to the left. You want me to get my tools? Yeah, I think it might be it's, me. It's, yeah, it's right. You, it's almost to the red. It's off to the left. Yeah, that Here. actually might be me. You think so? Yeah. I don't know. I think I got to zero just a little bit. Because I'm moving just a I little bit. Because I haven't had time to really zero it in. That thing crazy. I got my tools in a bag. I could zero it real quick. Just, it, I think it needs to come to the right a little bit. Okay, we're clear. Did we shoot everything? I think we did, just about. Yeah, I need to shoot your 40, the Canik and the Ruger. Okay. Let's do it now, okay. just to get the time over with. Okay. Yeah. Yep, you can go with the 40. I got, I got that full stack and pack. Okay. Yep. Actually, curiosity. You want to move and shoot on this one? No, I haven't shot this yet. So. Okay. Okay. Yeah, you get used to it. Well, you got a light. I was gonna. No. Nope. My Smith will actually fit in this too, which I was kind of surprised. She gonna have a little bit more kick. Okay, guys, got a Smith and Wesson SD forty VE. Yep. Forty caliber. Forty caliber. I haven't shot one of these before. We'll see how we go. He wanted to shoot this bad guys.
You see the recoil? Yeah, it's a little bit more to tame. Get that recoil. Putting some big holes in that mug though, man. Yeah. Dang. <laughs> that mug. Clear? Yep. Yeah, it put some big holes in it. You can tell the difference in the holes too. Yeah. Your 40 holes right there. You were close to red. Two 40 holes right there. You got a 40 hole right there. I wonder which one were the AR-15 holes. It probably was these. AR-15 I was putting right in here. So I think Oh, close to three. the red, yeah. Yeah, so shooting yeah, off to the left. Yeah, look what it did, yeah. That AR-15 loud too, isn't it? Yeah, that very loud. It's very loud. We're ears, guys. We're yep. ears. Yep. What are we shooting next? What you got next? Uh, what else we got over here? We got the Canic, we got the Ruger. Let's do the Ruger next. And then we got to get up out of here, guys. We're doing good timing so far. We still got to pack up. I got to go to work. <laughs> I don't, guys. I took off for this special event. Oh, he wants to go. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Hollows? It's not. Yeah, it's hollows. Okay. That's fine. Go ahead and let it rip. We don't have time to change it out for full metals. It's all good, though. Now, she going to kick. She's going to kick. So, make sure you get a good grip on her. That's why I got that uh, that talon grip on there. Not talon grip, but that uh, grip, that rubber grip. Okay, top right. Top right. Maybe. That's fine. That thing got a lot of uh Yeah, it's got a lot of flip. Yeah, it does. That was quick. Clear. That was eight. How you feel with that one? I like that. Did it feel pretty good? Feels pretty good. Especially with the grip that I put on there. Yeah, it makes definitely. it better, doesn't it? Yeah. Calms it down a little you bit. You were close, man. Close, you not bad very... for shooting for yep. the first time. And you hit one. Yeah. Not bad. Not bad. I guess the next one, we'll just aim here. Yep. See what we get, and we'll let you get some headshots. And uh, then we can roll up out of here, man. Oh, it's the canning. Now you're gonna love that. I changed the back <laughs> strap on that. Oh, nice. Okay. Yep. So you're gonna love that. I think you're really gonna like that. That canning is just smooth, man. What did you think about that 40 Smith and Wesson? Yeah, it was a little. It was a little much to to, to tame. Little kick. Yeah, I little kick tell. on that. So there's the option as they take and build this one out. He's out there on the bench. The uh, E320, I can actually have a different slide, different barrel, different recoil springs, and have the interchangeable, swap that out, and the magazine, and it can have a 40 as well. That's sweet. So we'll Lit all these up so we can basically throw this one away. What kind of ammo are we shooting? We shooting uh, Blazer? Blazer 124. Yeah. Blazer shoot pretty clean. That's nice. Yeah. What's the grain on this one? 124. 124? Yeah. 9 millimeter Luger. So just as a mental note, guys, the... Uh, the SIG P938, as well as the P320M18, both like to eat 124 grain rounds. So the 115, it has a tendency to stovepipe as it's popping out, just doesn't have the oomph behind it. I've not tested that theory on the regular P320, but definitely the, on the, uh, the 938, he likes his, uh, his uh, 124 grains for breakfast. We got 15% battery, doing perfect timing. Perfect. All right, you want to do a drill? You want to walk in, walk towards the enemy, walk towards? Yep, let me do that. And take them down. Roger that. There you go. There you go, there you go. Yep, we out. He survived. <laughs> <laughs> Although I think we got him earlier. Yeah, oh, we most definitely got him earlier. <laughs> Listen, that job right here, 
It looked like they got some kind of chicken pox or something. I don't know. That's just crazy. That is crazy. And guys, look on the channel for these targets. Would you say these are amazing? Those are great targets. I, I did a review on these. I like the splatter so you can actually see even from a distance what, what you're getting into. Yeah. And then another thing too, guys, if you're trying to keep record of where, you know, your, your bullets actually landed on the target, you can get, I have white out in my book bag and I just mark it. And some of them actually have round little circular stickers that you can just stick on it and take account. That way you know, you know, what your last shot was, but perfect. All right. Good day, man. That was good. That was fun. We're coming back out. Oh, yes. What we got here. Don't forget that bad baby. Don't forget the toy. Oh, yes. All right. All right, guys. We wrapping it up. We did some damage today. Today wasn't really about accuracy more so. I mean, we did a little bit of accuracy, but we came out to really just have some fun. You hear that shotgun. And um, so fun. He's wrapping it up here. Packing the toys up. Say what? Exactly. <laughs> All right, guys, we are wrapping it up. We got to head up out of here. Uh, next time, we can, we'll probably do like two or three hours. We had to kind of rush this one a little bit, but we still have fun. Still have fun. Definitely. And crunchy peanut butter. Same color as my skin. <laughs> crunchy <laughs> peanut butter <laughs> all right this is it guys so we're about to wrap it up and we are heading out guys check it out like we back here with uh hickok hickok holler at me hickok 45 holler at me yeah i was watching your videos you inspired me except i put a little bit of style and pizzazz in it yeah all right guys we wrapping it up Interesting. And I washed the car for no reason. And y'all check out this book bag. I've done a review on this book bag on my channel. I'm telling y'all, it holds up well. You know, everybody doesn't want to pay $300 for a damn book bag. So this book bag is sturdy. And you see how much stuff I have in it. It's a ton of stuff. It works well. All right, guys. So we wrapping it up. We're done today. Had a blast. Get ready for part two. It's coming, okay? Corral. We're out of here. Uh-oh. Road food. Oh, boy. Yeah, buddy. All right, guys, what, what what we got here today, bro? Man, you got to show me because you got some big boy toys here, man. Cool, man. So we got IWI, Uzi Ooh. Pro, Ooh. Beretta 1301. Okay. Galil Ace mm. uh, Pistol, Gen 1. All right. And it's in 7.62. Which one is in 7.62? The Galil. Okay, nice. Which one you like to shoot out of all of these or you really don't have a favorite? They're all pretty much the same. They are? Yeah. Where did you get this one from, though? I'm curious. Uh, ironically. The uh, subscriber's going to ask about that. And just found it on my own. Okay. All right. Let's see. You got the little mag right there. How many does that hold? This one holds 25. All right. Is the ammo pretty the, expensive? The, or? No, it shoots nine. So it, it shoots you know, 35 cents a round. Okay. Yeah. I will do the disclaimer on that because someone's going to say something. That is not a vertical grip that is an angled grip okay someone somewhere will say something about it all right and show them show them the one that i'm just in love with a little yeah, bit a surprise little? oh yeah there comes the cap you know. Arms DS9 right here, and then you've got the Sig Vernus Patrol right here. Mm. Nice, and you ready to go? Amen. What is this chamber then? 556. Five, All right, go ahead and show them this one real quick. They they have to witness the, the beauty. Oh man, 
Look at that, guys. And no, guys, it's not a, a staccato. It is not. Looks like one. Nice. All right. That's it, man. We appreciate you showing us that. Yeah. And then we'll be able to um, meet again one day. And we will discuss those things. Yeah, we'll have you out here. We'll shoot. There you go. All and right, we'll guys. We'll make the range lay out of it. Here we go. All right. All right, guys. So we are leaving out. I had a great time at the range. I had a freaking blast. So be looking out for part two, guys. We will be coming back to this place. It is amazing and, I, and it's just so beautiful up in this area. It's like up in a mountain almost, like it's crazy. But I'm heading out, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell so when I roll out the latest videos, you'll be able to receive them. And remember, I'm not from this planet.